Hello, welcome back to Levant TV Headlines. CS President Bashar al-Assad has registered to stand in next month's presidential election, which he is widely expected to win. An Egyptian court sentenced Muslim Brotherhood leader Mohammed Badia and 682 other alleged Islamists to death after two brief sessions which the defense partly boycotted. Staying in Egypt, a court banned the April 6 youth movement that spreadheaded the 2011 uprising against President Hosni Mubarak and has protested against the current military installed regime. Suicide bombers attacked several polling stations and security forces in Iraq, killing at least 18 people and wounding dozens days before legislative elections. Abdelaziz Bouteflika was sworn in as Algeria's president for a fourth term in a televised ceremony after his re-election. The Palestine Liberation Organization's Central Council adopted a plan to pursue attempts to join 60 UN bodies and international agreements. President Obama said the United States would unveil new sanctions on Russia targeting individuals, companies and high-tech defense items. And at least 22 people, including three staff members of medical charity Médecins Sans Frontières, were killed during a weekend attack by gunmen on a Central African hospital. Malaysian police said they arrested nine people after in, on Monday under a security law on suspicion of involvement in a terror group with overseas links. And to read more, please visit levant.tv. That was it for today. Thanks for watching.